Eldridge. I am a first year student. I'm interviewing for the secretary position. I'm originally from Troy, Alabama. I'm a nutrition science major in the and um, I want to be a sports medicine physician and hopefully work for a team one day. I attended Charles Henderson High School. I was involved in marching band where I played clarinet. I was band captain and section leader. I was secretary of SGA. I was a school ambassador, so involvement in my school and community has always been something that I uh, was very passionate about. And I tried to make that point all four years of high school. So about my journey from uh, uh, Alabama to Ohio, my dad lives in Cleveland, so I've been coming to Ohio for years. It's like a second home to me, really close to my heart. So when I was considering colleges, of course, OSU was on my radar. And I came to tour, and I fell in love with it. And one of the big things that um, brought me to OSU was moral scholars. I received a scholarship, the excellent scholarship, and uh, it was just a really diverse community. They push you academically, and um, when I did the early arrival program, it just made OSU feel smaller even before I stepped foot on campus. So that was something that I really um, enjoyed. And I'm currently involved in Ladies of Leadership, which is through um, the Office of Diversity and Inclusion. I am a representative for the Siebert Hall Activities Council, uh, where we plan different um, Thanks for the residents, and I live in the Moral Scholars Learning Community, where we volunteer um, at urban schools in the Columbus um, area. So I was first exposed to BSA at Welcome Week, the involvement fair. It was very overwhelming, but when I finally uh, got to the um, table, everyone was really nice to me, really welcoming, just telling me what the org was about, how they like to unite the black community, and I knew that was something that I wanted to look more into. And so then I attended the family reunion, and it was exactly what I expected. Just a sense of family and community. Uh, being a freshman, it was nice to have people there that you could talk to, and it was a safe space for me. So I knew this was somewhere where I wanted to continue to come, um, especially my first year, just to get to know people and uh, get involved. Uh, when I found out that you had hall rep, so I became a hall rep for Seabird. And so then that way, that gave me a way to get involved subtly with BSA, uh, like helping out with like the Black Excellence Ball and things like that. So I knew that I wanted to uh, pursue a higher position. I love what the org stands for, just uniting African American students. Being at a PWI, it can be difficult to find a group that you can like, relate to. So um, not only like of the fun aspects, but also uh, academically and professional development, I think, is a major uh, key. Uh, I can set a positive example. People are watching all the time on your social media when you go out when you're not even uh, thinking about it. So you don't want anyone to take anything that you see in a negative light. So uh, you don't want that to like, deter them from wanting to join the organization. So I think that being a, a positive example at all times is important. Working in teams. I've Everything you do have to work in a team from group projects to um, a special org like this, the E board, just helping each other out and always like being the backbone for someone else, just lending a helping hand. If you can't contribute ideas, just contributing uh, your time to help others. And I know the secretary position, you send out a lot of emails, you have to be aware of time, so organization I think is key. Uh, you don't want to send out any information late. Um, because that could affect like the turnout of your programs. So just being on top of everything and making sure you get things done in a timely manner, um, I feel is important. The time commitment, uh, as you guys discussed uh, when we, uh, at the uh, e-board um, presentation, um, Thursdays on the weekends during the week. So I'll be dedicated to the position and I know how much time and effort goes into this. So I think I'm ready to tackle that. Innovation, coming up with new ideas. I know that we send like a lot of emails and you guys do things on social media, but maybe going out to the residence halls or posting flyers everywhere to make sure that everyone knows what's going on and not just relying on like emails or flyers. I think would be a way to get more people to come out. Every good conversation starts with good listening. Um, in order to take direction, you have to be able to listen. When you're trying to come up with programs, you have to listen to the ideas of everyone else. Um, and then you can piece together what one person says with someone else to come up with the best program possible. Uh, I hope to gain professional development, how to conduct myself, 
um, in business meetings, how to run a meeting effectively, uh, professional dress, and not only in college, but that's a skill that you're going to have to use as you can, um, continue through the workforce. So it's good to start developing those skills now um, while you're in college. And also confidence. Uh, you have to be confident in what you're putting out there, because if you're not confident, that's not people aren't going to resonate with that. They're not going to want to come to whatever it is that um, you're putting on. So I feel like just standing firm in your work, and that'll, if you prove that you're passionate about it, that'll make other people want to come out and uh, be passionate also. Uh, just further developing leadership skills, effective communication, effective listening, creating new strategies to um, get things done, uh, being determined, and following examples set forth by higher people of higher positions or in uh, past board members is important. Spreading diversity. I know a lot of people are like, well, it's called the Black Student Association, but I just want to uh, get out to the campus to let them know that everyone is welcome. Um, promote diversity and just give, uh, like I mentioned previously, give them a safe space where they can come and interact with all people. And networking, not only networking through advisors, but networking with other organizations, um, doing collaborations, I feel is important just to bring something new to campus and just really show um, unity is important. So I hope to gain networking skills from this position.